Glasses on. Okay, I am now uh, wandering through the hallway. Attempting to get some modicum of steadiness here. And uh, I see two figures in the uh, foreground. Uh, cannot make out one of them. In fact, I can't make out either of them. So I'm just going to try to sidestep. Yes, and if you look carefully, you probably will be able to see my reflection in the door here. Jeff, would you mind getting the door? Thank you. Got some strafe shots here. All right, I'm gonna go navigate down this uh, carpet. <coughs> carpet looking. I can press 200 pounds. We will ignore that. Jeff being gay, decidedly gay. All right, I'm gonna wander up my hallway now. Hopefully my room will be open, otherwise I'll have to use my keys. Yeah, Jeff has injured himself. So uh, again, door boy. Uh, other side. Let's stay out of the shot. Uh, I can hear you talking. You don't need to hide out of the shot. Does anyone else feel like they're in The Shining? Just say yes if so. Uh, I... Uh, we're missing the little uh, tricycle kid though. The little what? Tricycle kid. There's a little tricycle kid in The Shining. Um, He's like going down a hallway in a tricycle and all of a sudden like, you know, uh, some stuff happens. Oh, well, let's go down to that dark room. Uh, yes, this used to be my room until I moved out. And Jeff, get out of the shot. No, and now I'm guessing, yes, yes, this is in fact my room. I will open the door. This is unlocked. And, oh yeah, it's nice and dark in here, so I'll have to hit the lights. There we go. Yes, here is my wonderful computer. And my collection of DVDs. And, yes, that is a Nintendo Virtual Boy. Underneath the desk, you probably can't see it, but that's my subwoofer. And here is my lighty up mouse. Oh boy, what have I done? I hope I didn't click anything. Somebody's online. Hey, did you remember to turn off the porno? There is no porno on this computer. And somebody has oh. messaged me. What does it say? Uh, do I know anything about Pearl? Uh, I shall return type B U S Y space B R B. Well, the thing is, it's not taking anything. You forgot to put the cursor into allow me. Please insert the CD ROM. Jeff, something. stop playing black and white. We'll just ignore spade right now. And yes, this is my bed, complete with my root beer and gaming hat. Uh the no not kill kittens poster and the Dodge Neon SRT4 poster and the Nintendo and TV. Okay, I think it's about time we take a trip down to the Narc's room. I have a little surprise for him. Well, not really a surprise, but I think you'll all find it entertaining. I'm just yes. going to borrow this uh, marker for a second, if you'll follow me. Light off. Door is closed. Moving forward. What's this say? What did you write on here? Let's go. What's up? Hey, that's my roommate. Like my oh no, no nipple. nipple. Oh, nipple. Like that? That's just yeah. Jay. Oh, he seems to be without Silent Bob right now. Uh, the guy I just wrote that on his door, that's a narc. We call him because, well, he's a narc and a fucking moron. Jeff, your face is totally black. I don't care as long as the people can hear me. People cannot hear you. Oh, by the way, thankful 
before you drink. Very important around here, because if they catch you drinking, they'll want some of your beer. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, moving on. My arm is getting really tired yeah, now. You do that. Yes. Okay. One fifty stew. The storage closet. The untold files. Damn. It's locked. They have thwarted our plans. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. The words of a moron. See, custodian. Is he really a custodian, or is that just an alias? Or am I just a moron? The answer lies within. And yes, in fact, he is a moron. Alright. Now, this is the RP. He is a head narc. He is the person who will drive us absolutely nuts. He likes to get on to the girls, though, a little too well, if you know what I mean. Yes, he does, in fact, you know. That is the big screen. I don't know if you can see it right now. It is not on. Let's follow Jay for a while, shall we? Shut away from me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got one of them, too. What is it? See? Sure. A little flashlight keychain. Jeff, where are you? I lost you. I'm just going to go and grab my bag. You're going to go and grab what? I'm going to go and grab my bag. Oh, don't, don't. Hey. Oh, no. You almost made me out of Can I grab my bag? So. You're hurting my eyes. Yes, we have a video camera. Yeah, those are pretty cool. What's that thing all about? I don't know. I'm just walking around with videos. This is actually Jeff's. He's borrowing it from somebody. What are you, what are you filming? This says, you right now. The Criminal Justice Club and Residence Life are proud to present to all resident students a keychain flashlight. As seen here. You got what? What does he have? Keychain flashlight. Yeah, you go check your mailbox. You got one in there. Yeah, you got one right Yeah, I put it online. Hello. What? What? What's with the camera? What? Like... Hey, hey, don't hit the camera. It's not live. It's real funny. Oh, it's good. Sir, you're failing this test miserably. I'm carrying a giant video camera on my back. Sir, that's no excuse. Now, sir, I'm gonna need to ask you to come. That's the officer. Yeah, fuck off. All right. Anyway, one last place we need to go to Upstairs? investigate the, the lousy computers of the lab and where they do not have power oh. aid at the moment. Well, let's see the mysterious elevator. Some say it only goes up, but I have other theories. The door shall open momentarily. Please remain seated till the door has opened. Welcome to elevator. Please select your floor. Let's try this one. Thank you for selecting two. Going up. Loving in out of later. Shut the hell up. Loving in out going. No. No. Thank you for riding elevator. After you. All right. Here we go. Some high quality video here. All right, where are we going? Uh, you're allowed by bus. Oh, yeah, yeah. I keep forgetting. This is the 
is a pool table that has what's known as the tech curve. The yes. tech curve being the curve in the table that makes this a non-standard uh, pool table, but twice as much fun. Actually, I find it quite annoying. Oh, don't think so. You're just too traditional in your thinking. No, not too traditional in my thinking. It's just annoying when you're trying to shoot and it's all over the place. Okay, I'll just get a little quick around in here. He seems to always be up here. I don't know who this kid is. He's trouble. Dude, wow, that's a hard thing. Uh, we got Gary out there. <laughs> yeah, just getting some video of school. <laughs> Why? Yeah. Why? Why? Um, something like that, yeah. All right. I'll attempt to venture down the stairs with this thing. This is gonna be if fun. I drop it, don't holler at me. I'm gonna venture over the window here so I can see Jeff's car. And yes, there it is. You can't really see it too well though because this camera gets really uh, lousy picture quality when in highly contrasted light. But there it is, it's just the same. See, this is my balding head. This is what happens when you get too stressed. I you lose hair. Strafe shot. <laughs> Anyway, let's and go back to where we began. The door for us, so let us proceed with our adventure. Thank you. Another shining shot. What? Jeremy, he's behind us. Who is he? Jeremy. Ah. What are you guys taping for? Whatever. Ow. Just for fun. Boop. All right. Uh, You're apparently going into this Please check the uh, patch job oh, here. Wait. This now, is initially, a hole was put here because our is were having some fun in wrestling and put a huge hole here. It was cheaply uh, patched up by maintenance, and then our good friends Josh Russell, Justin Wilcox, and Jed Kirchner came Bless in them. late one Saturday night and smashed it out again. It has now once again been cheaply repaired by maintenance staff. Will it be painted? Probably not. Would it be nice? Yes. Will it happen? Probably no. not. No. Well, I'll go check on the status of the computer and, repairs. And we must get Eric. There's Eric. He sleeps all the time. David! Ah, the voice of God. Oh, no, it's just Henry. Oh, Anything I see the but computer God. repairs mm -hmm. have uh, come along, and we've got something resembling a computer here. Uh, and here we've got something resembling a reclining human. Yeah. <laughs> That's just Henry. He's annoying. Yes. <laughs> I want my goddamn manuals back. Oh, we were just down there. He also smells quite atrociously since he only bathes on the weekends. Yes, yes, I do because I'm afraid of what will happen if I go in the stalls here. Nothing happens, believe me. I don't get it. I go in there and I don't get packed up the ass. Neither do I. Yeah, but you have a different wing. Well, no, he Same used to be wing. down in this wing. He used to be. The I time don't know why he is switched. now. Eh, make a joke about you, Henry. I don't know. It depends on whether it's going to be a film. Um, yes it will be. That's the whole no. Please, 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 please. No, no, no. Come on. What is it about? It's a sexual joke. No. Please, come on, Henry. No, come on, no. take one for the team. No. What team? This Us. team. The Us. A team? Yes, the A team. Well. Dave, do you have any comment to make about this? Do it for Servo. Do it for Crow. Do it for Mike and the other guy. But they Joel? escaped already. Joel. How about Joe? Joe? Joel. Isn't there a Joe? And not for Joel. me. Do it for... For your roommate, Dave, who's dying of cancer. The problem isn't that he's afraid of getting it packed up the ass. He's afraid of not getting it packed up the ass. <laughs> oh. Ooh, Henry seems to have a side we don't know. And what are you talking about? It's very obvious and very pronounced. Where this began. Thus shall end the broadcast day. If you can see me in the window, I'm David Lupa, cameraman. Good night. <laughs>